we welcome you to Coleman Coliseum in Tuscaloosa, Alabama, Missouri, in the Alabama Crimson Tide, wrapping up a big day of women's college basketball in the SEC. Open on the wing, Haley Troop knocks down a triple, and Missouri is in front for the first time. There's a feed into the post. Blackwell hands it off up and in for Haley Frank on the left side. That's seven in a row for Mizzou. Earlier that any team on any given night can can get beat, and you're seeing that coaches are making adjustments. It's the second half. Four free throws, then Missouri misses in the game. I'm not sure all of those metrics are working out right now as Missouri pushes it out to its biggest lead, up ten. Missouri, they're Christy trying Curry. to now establish some isolation plays with their guard play, um, and you can see that that's something that's been beneficial for them. A lot of dribbling right now. Here's Dembella, three on the way, and good. Bell does Hanson. You can see the flare screen that they ran for Hanson there, and she got it. It's like, am I open, and should I take this shot? Asia Blackwell was open on the perimeter there. It may have been a quiet first half, but a fast start to the second half for Blackwell. She's got five points for Missouri out of the gate. Out of the practice gym, and she'll see Brittany Davis in there getting shots up early. Started 19 games, and she's playing uh, 20 minutes, but she's got to cancel out LaDasia Williams. You can't allow your center on one end to outperform the center on the other end. Jump shooting continues to be good for Missouri. Haley Frank that time. The fight for equality, and we're going to continue to do so uh, because, again, I've got a nine-year-old. Her name is Justice, so I want her to have these opportunities and, and, and have access to them. In higher, um, uh, when, you're, when you're able to hire, hire someone like her. She's done a phenomenal job at the collegiate, and you have to defend uh, flare screens, ball screens, curls. Um, and right now, Blackwell's going to have to make a play with the shot clock winding down. She sees Hanson wow. for the three in the corner. Oh, my gosh. And when you do, you've got to secure the rebound because then, to me, your press was successful. 12 points now for Megan Abrams. Able to drive it all the way to the rim that time. And now Blackwell able to drive it all the way to the rim. Finishes with the left hand. Seventh rebound of the game for Asia Blackwell. She feeds it inside. And a bucket down low. That's a couple of baskets now for Kelly off the bench. She had the one at the end of the third quarter and now has four points in the game. I thought what hurt Alabama initially was those turnovers, um, but I think Alabama team will take this game, they will process it, and be better because of it. Skylar Rice with the bucket there, and that's her first basket in an SEC game in her Missouri career. So you saw the reaction from the Missouri bench, long three. Won't go for Hannah Barber. You mentioned just a moment ago, Jada Rice. It's her sixth double-digit scoring game of the season. And a good win all the way around Nikki Fargus for the Missouri Tigers on this Sunday evening.